think it was when I picked up a book in a used bookstore when I was about 13 years old, a book titled One, Two, Three, Infinity by George Gamow, who was a great physicist and cosmologist from the 1930s, 40s, and 50s. And in that book, I read about how the laws of physics uh, govern, control what goes on in the universe, and they're the foundation for technology, they're the foundation for the universe behaving as it does. And I got so excited by this, I decided I wanted to study the laws of physics and understand how they gave rise to what we see and what we can do. I'd actually want to go forward in time by maybe a thousand or two thousand years and see what has happened and then be able to come back after having seen that, come back to this era. Uh, I'm more interested in the future than I am in the past. Well, I think for students, for people who are thinking they wanted to become a serious scientist and work on things like, like I have, uh, it's very hard. You have to work very hard uh, in order to uh, have real success. And so you need to love it. Uh, in order to be able to work very hard, you need to love it, you need to enjoy it. And this is a piece of advice then that I got from my grandfather when I was only four years old. He said, when you grow up, if you find a job that is like play, that is fun, then you will have succeeded in life. And that is the key to my career in large measure. It has been fun. And it being fun like this has enabled me to work extremely hard and have some measures of success.